Welcome back to my channel guys. If you guys don't know who I am and this is your first time to my channel, welcome. I am going to be talking a lot about trading stocks, uh, how to build credit. Everybody needs credit in the United States if you want to do real estate. Um, I'm on my way to get my real estate license. Building credit is a must for me um, in terms of real estate investing and real estate uh, in general. But besides that, welcome to my channel. I hope you uh, stick around and I guarantee you'll learn something new. Today, we have American Express. Yes, I'm gonna cover the address, but here it is. Let's open it. I wanna do this cool. How do I do this cool? Put a pen through it and then... All right, take the whole packet out. It's a thick stack of paper. Welcome to your new Blue Cash Everyday card. This is my American Express Blue Cash Everyday credit card that they have sent me. Ooh, it's like clear. It's really nice. Like, it's see-through. Let's, let's peel this because I hate this so much. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I don't have nails, guys. So... I got approved for $2,000 on this card. Um, I applied just last week. So if you guys don't know, this is now my fourth credit card. Um, where's my wallet? If you guys watched my other video, um, I got the Apple card. So if you guys wanna see a review on the Apple card, go check it out. I guess you would call this a gateway into the American Express. Um, I did apply for this, I wasn't pre-approved. Uh, if you're wondering what you need to be approved for it, um, I suggest you have a credit score of around 700 before applying. Most of the people I know who got approved uh, usually have a credit score around 7, 700, 720. But I've read somewhere that they go down to as low as even like 660. Definitely think about getting this card. I'm going to talk about the perks of having this card. Stay tuned. It's time to get smart, guys. I got you. Yep. Just they, the glare from my light sources makes it look really bad, so I try not to wear it. Just for you guys, you know, you guys are special. The first thing I'll talk about is the sign-up bonus. So you will get $150 towards your card uh, statement credit if you spend $1,000 in the first three months. But conveniently for you guys and for me, American Express is giving everyone three more months since of the uh, economic hardship right now so everyone's not really spending money on everything they want so they're giving you six months in total to spend one thousand dollars for the 150 dollars 150 dollars statement credit that you can spend i think that's super generous i think that the fact that they still have a sign up bonus even in times of uh, everyone being quarantined and the economy being so bad i think that's pretty generous but with this card you'll be able to earn three percent back on supermarket and grocery store purchases. Uh, there is a list, so it doesn't include super super centers, uh, super, super supermarket. I don't know, like super super, like Walmart and Target are considered like super supermarkets. So this card does not apply to those. Um, but for stores such as ShopRite and Whole, Fo Whole Foods, um, I'll have a list right here for all of them. Um, but that is convenient for me because there's a shop right like right down this block from my house. So definitely gonna be putting all the groceries on this baby. This card also allows you to get 2% back on gas stations. There is also another list of gas stations that this card applies for, so check it out. Here's the list of all the gas stations. And uh, lastly, you'll get 1% back on all other purchases with this card. So instead of using a debit card, use your cards that give you cash back to uh, maximize the amount you can save. With the 3% back on grocery stores, there is a $6,000 limit. Every year you get 3% back on grocery stores up to $6,000 and everything after $6,000 is going to be 1%. That makes more sense. I like to collect credit cards and um, I'm 18 so I'm trying to get as much credit cards that have 0% annual fee as much as possible right now. So I've collected about four so far as of april 20th 420 i plan on building a solid floor of credit cards that i do not need to cancel in the future my credit history will be solid 
even if I open new credit cards in the future. If you guys are interested in learning more about how to build credit, definitely comment below. Um, and if we get 20 likes, if we get 20 likes on this video, I will make a how to build good credit video. 20 likes, like you guys probably get like a thousand times more than that on Instagram.